I'm not sure Bowman understands who we are, asking us to use an innocent woman as leverage. Yeah, she's one of those handlers who thinks we just do wet work. To be clear, we are not harming this woman unless she tries to kill one of us. Roger that. The only way we're going to get General Barrow is through his daughter, Erendira. We can use her as bait to draw Barrow out, but we need her to cooperate. Do whatever you have to in order to convince her. I asked Pakatari to send us a vehicle. We'll leave a marker so the Rebels can pick up these supplies later. Buckle up, people. drone. There she is. Keep in mind, she's our only lead. We need her. And if she don't want to help? Like I said, she's our only lead. for General Barrow. Lo siento. Mire, I cannot help you. You can and you will. We know the General is your father. We only want to meet him. Que? Why should I believe you? Because you don't have a choice. You think the cartel Sicarios are bad? We are the people they have nightmares about. Papa? Some gringos have found me. Americanos. I am not hurt. They say they only want to meet. No, I do not trust them. He says you are malos, peligrosos, but he has given me a location. Saddle up. We need General Barrow alive, but I don't expect him to be friendly. Want to get to that RV first. Let's roll.
the RP. Keep your eyes open. I don't trust the big man. over. Get him! Stop that captain from running. Open fire. Kind with her heart, stand that. Not me, no. She could have hidden from my enemies in England and in Spain. Instead, she stays in Bolivia, teaching in a poor school in a dangerous area. She's trying to serve my penance for me. You're no angel, sir. But I think your daughter's the kind of girl who does what she wants for her own reasons. Why else would she do such a thing? She could have lived a life of comfort, in peace. Maybe she loves her country too much to leave it. See, si, perhaps. Perhaps she's too much like me. It is not so good to be too patriotic. Approaching extraction point. Keep your eyes open. Bastardo, these were good men! I was in La Paz trying to speak to the president when you had my daughter call me. I have known for some time that our relationship with Santa Blanca is untainable, but I could not convince the bureaucrats there of our situation. They wouldn't let you speak with the president. No. And I fear that I revealed my intentions to men and women who are already in the pocket of sueño. But today, corruption is the Bolivian way of life. I've been trading too many shots with Unidad to feel any sympathy, sir. I had wanted order when I made peace with Santa Blanca. But it is an order fueled by corruption and violence against our citizens. That is my responsibility, and I will help make it right. It's an uphill battle. But if you don't want any more violence for Bolivia, for your daughter, we have to shut this down proper. I may have a few loyal officers who are willing to see things my way. Also, I have a friend, a colonel in the regular army. He may be able to help. But all of this is going to take time. Then let's start now.
Nomad, this is Bowman. Beautiful work in the Bloody Oro. With General Barro turning against the cartel and our own assets protected, shit is gonna get tough for corrupted officers inside Unidad. And for the Santa Blanca friends. Hell yeah. With Barrow and his military contacts on our side, you can expect Unidad patrols to get a lot less lenient with cartel members. Way to build tension. Exactly. And give our rebel friends more room to operate. Then we'll be moving on to rougher terrain. I'll be in touch. Nomad out. El Mudo was going to try to kill me, just as I was going to kill him. Black is for vengeance. White is for safety. Gold is for success. Ahora, I ask you, how can any saint grant contradictory prayers from two different men? It has been my experience that gods always side with the man who has the most money, the most men, and the most power. I had lost the one man I could always trust, mi hermano. How many men would be more loyal to him than to me? How much power would he take? Would that be enough for him to take me out? I would always have an advantage, though. I grew up with the man. I knew how his mind worked. I knew his next move before he did. I just had to be patient. 